Hey everyone, Charlie here, Vidyard Social Media Manager. I spend my days creating, sharing, and watching my fair share of video content, so I have a pretty good idea of what works and what doesn't. Today we're going to be focusing on video for real estate agents. Selling property can be an incredibly tough job at times. Between valuations, client relations, and contracts, there can be a lot to think about. And that's not to mention actually promoting the house. After all, if no one sees the house, you're gonna have a tough time selling it. That's where video marketing comes in. You can use video as a buying or selling agent to stand out from other realtors, make a personal connection with prospective clients, and ultimately sell more properties. If you're a broker or an agent, you can use video to save time, build your brand, as well as train other agents. I know what you're all thinking. You've already got a million things to do. Why add one more? The answer? because video is extremely powerful. What makes it so effective for real estate pros? First, stop struggling to simply describe what's great about a property. Video lets you show and tell potential buyers exactly why they should be interested. And it makes it a lot easier to explain things clearly as well. Second, cut down on no-shows and get more replies. Video can actually help you book more meetings. Send out recorded messages using email and social media to connect with clients. These video messages are 40% more likely to be opened and three times as likely to earn a response. Third, save time. Once you've made a video, you can reshare it. If you wanna give an old video a fresh lease on life, simply add a new introduction and boom, done. And finally, drive deals forward. Video makes it easy to resolve questions faster, showcase more amenities, and create a personal connection with your clients. So what are you waiting for? Let's mark you as sold on video and dive into how to create it. There are a ton of different real estate videos that you can create. Let's talk about a few of our favorites. One, outreach videos give you a way to send a warmer introduction to a potential client. Two, customer testimonial videos showcase the value of your services by highlighting happy clients. Three, Property tour videos show off the places that you're selling in a way that text and photos alone simply can't. Add some drone footage to really kick things up a notch. Four, educational videos are your chance to build trust with potential clients by helping them learn about the property buying and selling process. And finally, five, realtor profile videos let you put your best foot forward and introduce yourself with personality. This gives potential clients a chance to get to know you and like you, so they wanna work with you instead of your competitor. Now that you know what you can do with video, it's time to start making one. Here are a couple tips for doing it well without stressing yourself out. Choosing the right equipment is super important. You can get a lot done with simply using your smartphone and a video app. This is especially true for testimonials and outreach videos. But if you're looking to film high quality property tours, you'll want to invest in some higher quality equipment like a digital SLR camera, lens, and a tripod. Once you've got the tools you need, you'll want to start planning. You're going to want to set aside half of your time for the planning phase, about 20% of the time for filming, and at least 30% for editing. One of the most important parts of the planning phase is script writing. You don't have to follow it word for word, but you're going to want to have a good idea of what you want to say before you hit record. If you're the one that's going to be on camera, you'll want to think about what to wear. The best advice we can give you is to dress for your audience. Think about what conveys professionalism, but won't alienate people. When you move on to editing, be sure to add background music. Choose something that supports your message rather than distracting from it. And lastly, put some thought into your thumbnail. This is one of the most important parts of your video because it's what people use to decide whether or not to watch. Consider adding some extra oomph by adding an animated GIF as your thumbnail. This is a great way to capture your audience's attention and entice them to click play. Those are just a few of the Vidyard team's top tips for creating real estate videos that pop. Do you create videos for real estate? What are some of your tips? Drop your advice and questions down in the comments below. Thank you so much for watching and we'll see you next time.